Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Lego Cougar 12 here today, doing a review review on the Hobbit uh, Riddles for the Ring set. It's set number is seven nine zero zero zero. Um, so first off, Merry Christmas, everybody. Uh, not that was yesterday. So in the comments below, just list one thing that you got for Christmas that you really enjoyed. Uh, if you feel like it. I'll start. I got a MacBook, so I can, which means more videos more often, because I don't have to fight for the computer to put them on and edit anymore. So I have my own, and videos will be coming faster, awesomely, and stuff. Um, so just kind of more news. I'm trying hard to get the new DC superhero kind of sets. Um, uh, I'm not anywhere close near a uh, Target or anything, so it's kind of hard to. Uh, get up there but anyways so here we are back on the set um, it's a great set it's small I think it runs for ten dollars I'm not sure I got it for Christmas but um, it's a very nice set easy um, so yeah let's just take a look at the characters in this set alright guys here we have Bilbo Baggins uh, he's the main character in the Hobbit which the movie's now out, and if you haven't seen it, go and see it. I think it's a pretty amazing movie. Others not. But, so, he has the sword, or the dagger, uh, that Frodo uses, because uh, he used it first, and then Frodo gets it in the Lord of the Rings trilogy. Uh, he has the orange hair, little face, and the small body, red shirt. Just that back printing, and I think he has a double sided head. Oh, he does. Right there, that's his double sided head. So, there's Bilbo. Now we'll go to uh, Smeagol or Gollum, whatever one you prefer. Alright, so there's the weirdo. Um, he's just the same as you get him in Shelob. The shield upset from the Lord of the Rings, except he that this is the one from Shelob, and that's the one from this one. Uh, different face, but the rest is all the same. So that's pretty much it with him. The only thing that moves are his arms up and down. That's it, pretty much. A little back thing. So now we're just gonna get to the part of the set. The all right, guys. And now we have the main part of the set. Uh, you have the place where the ring is, but technically in the movie, the ring is in Gollum's loin cloth, uh, not on a rock. But just kind of show the features of this rock, which is very detailed. Uh, just a lot of small pieces. You have the slow mechanism that hides it down. No ring, boom, ring. No ring, boom. No ring, boom. Um, so that's kind of the main part. These open here. They kind of open up, so on and so forth. You can make them completely shut like that. Then the ring can't really pop out when you do that, though. Uh, so just kind of have it a little bit out. There we go. Then you have the boat, which Smeagol or Gollum approaches, f not Frodo, Bilbo in. Uh, during the scene, he's with the dwarfs, and they're in the kind of Gollum, or not, Goblin, sorry guys, Goblin cave, 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 and Bilbo kind of falls with this Goblin, and the Goblin gets killed by Smeagol or Gollum. And then he's all freaking out. Smeagol comes on the boat like this, kind of paddling silently through the water. My precious. That kind of stuff. And then they play a game of riddles. Um, so that's pretty much it for this set, guys. It's a very good one, small one, if you want to like start off into the Hobbit sets. Um, it's. I'll probably give it a. 10 out of 10. Yeah, that seems right. Price is okay. Maybe a little cheaper, though. But other than that, the figures are good. 
the set, the detail, it's amazing. Um, I don't know, but let me know what you guys think down below. Uh, say what you think it deserves. And don't forget to leave your favorite gift that you got for Christmas. Don't forget that. And then uh, comment. So obviously comment. Like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Whatever. Five stars. Uh, and then subscribe. Tell your friends. Hey guys, I know this awesome, awesome reviewer on YouTube. He's so great. You know, just something like that. I, I am, but you know. So anyways. Just... Tell everybody about me. Let's just let's get an awesome review channel. I have my computer now, so we're gonna be rocking, spitting out videos a lot. Um, in order to do that, I'm gonna need subscribers to watch my videos so I get money from YouTube, which I'm now a partner. Yes. Um, so comment, rate, subscribe, tell your friends so we can get more sets coming on out. All right, thanks, guys.